With the space shuttle ending, fair or unfair to say that the Russians become the leading space exploration country in the world? I wouldn't say that, actually. Uh, we're in a partnership, it's an international partnership with the Russians and other countries right now. We're all working together on the International Space Station. On the space station, the Russians are as dependent on us as we are upon them. It's a true collaboration. Now, in these next few years, it's true that we'll be launching American astronauts on Russian vehicles. But where else in the world but in the United States of America would be, we be so bold but to say our industry is capable of doing something that only government powers have done in the past? That, to me, that's a true testament of this country's will and strength. But is that true? Is American private industry and capital capable of keeping up uh, with what needs to be done in the exploration of space, in which the Russians, the Chinese, the Japanese, and many others, uh, Europeans, are now engaged? Well, I think American free enterprise is uh, tremendously capable. Just look at our company, SpaceX. We've already launched our private spacecraft into Earth orbit. We've flown it uh, a lap and a half around the Earth. We've entered it successfully into the atmosphere and recovered it uh, off the coast of California. Um, I, I believe in, in the next uh, three years and you know, roughly that period, we'll be able to launch astronauts on our vehicle, the Dragon. Well, there are similarities and differences in what's going on now. Private companies, uh, private enterprise, has built all of our spacecraft. Uh, the difference today is we now are emphasizing commercial space ventures. Commercial enterprises are there to make money, not for exploration. Uh, the only entities that can ever afford exploring, exploring the, uh, our whole universe out here is uh, government entities. And that's why you see you know, Russia, China, India, the United States. So I think that that aspect of it is what's going to be suffering the most as we go forward is the spirit of exploration that has so many benefits because you're facing real obstacles and having to overcome them with your new solutions and those new solutions that technology feel, feeds out into our commercial area. That's going to be missing. If you've got it, watch it. If you don't, call your TV provider to get HDNet today.